if you don't fit into the frame, especially for women, that people have in their minds, you have to come and break that framework. My name is Nivriti Rai. I live in Bangalore. I am the country head for Intel India, as well as the vice president for Intel's global supply chain. I have always loved numbers. I have always loved mathematics, love information coming out of data, the ability that technology has to create value for humanity, for people and saving lives, improving the quality of lives. I feel, isn't that what evolution is? The belief of the analyst is adoption of AI will increase the global GDP by as much as 26%. What has happened due to automation, industrial robotics, and AI, it has created a level playing field for men and women. Women can equally work in factories and industries like men because of the advent and adoption of technologies like this. That is what artificial intelligence can do. 10, 12 years ago, my team was building a product and we made tiny little mistake. Anybody who was a somebody was getting so upset that, you know, we made a mistake, we shouldn't have given this responsibility to Nivriti's team in India. It was such a difficult time because $2 billion revenue were hinging on this product. It actually prepared me for the bigger and bigger battles. My success started from there and also taught me a lesson that there's no problem that cannot be solved. If you can define a problem, then we can come up with a solution. So it made me hungry, it made me ready, and it made me fearless. So it started early. My desire for designing, creating, I actually designed for myself. And I'll give you one example. I embroidered City of London skyline with gold thread in a very dark blue-green kind of sari. Came out amazing. I often do that, you know, when I travel. It's like a conversation starter. I break the ice with that. So one myth I would like to bust about women is oftentimes people believe that women are not risk takers. Also, if somebody is interested or uh, leverages the creative side of their brain, they cannot be good in mathematics. I'm both. I'm a huge risk taker. So I have the logic and the creative part of my brain both, you know, working in turbo mode. Ask me more about the challenges I faced. How did I solve? I bruised my knees and my elbows. I don't want others to fall. I want to share recipes that people can leverage and avoid a pitfall or two. If you feel that your voice is not that loud, there are ways to work around. Stand up, increase your volume by using your hands Speak louder, bend forward, you know, get the voice, voice come closer to the people that you're talking has helped me tremendously. Step back, try to understand the differences and be inclusive of people. Somebody who, you know, is not speaking much, ask them a question. Do you have a suggestion or an idea? Or somebody who is speaking a lot, can you give pause for a moment that, you know, person XYZ could speak in? Oftentimes, you know, you make mistakes at work. Do not take those mistakes as something that is wrong about you. It's like, you know, I overcooked the pizza. Doesn't make me a bad cook. It just happened. Know that, you know, these are the 10 steps that you had to take and one, you know, was wrong. Let's learn from it and fix it.
My edge is I'm a technologist, and I know technology is the cheapest way to help people. I'm a woman, and nurturing and caring comes easy to me.